Cleaning faucet aerators regularly is an important step in maintaining the highest quality of water flowing out of faucets in your home. Aerators are screens made of metal or plastic that attach to the end of the faucet and enhance water pressure by dividing the flow into dozens of tiny streams. The screens may accumulate tiny particles of sediment that have corroded from inside your home's plumbing and the hot water tank. Screens should be cleaned at least every six months and after every time there's a disruption of water service to your home. There are two primary types of aerators, standard and cache aerators. This video will show you how to remove and clean both types. Standard aerators screw on to the tip of the faucet. With regular cleaning, you may be able to unscrew standard aerators with your hand. Other times, you may need a wrench or tool to help give you enough torch to loosen the aerator housing. Once it is loose, finish unscrewing the aerator by hand. You may notice a few small black, brown, white, or copper-colored flecks on the screen. This is metal and plastic that has corroded from your plumbing system. Separate the parts of the screen and put them in a small container and rinse them off. If residue has accumulated on the screen or housing, you may wish to soak them in vinegar for 20 minutes or so. Then scrub the screen with a small, clean brush. Reassemble aerator and reattach it to the faucet. Test the faucet to ensure you installed it correctly. Then you are good for another six months. Either mark the next time the aerators need cleaned on your calendar, or plan on cleaning faucet aerators when you check your smoke detector batteries and change your clocks. Cache aerators are inserted into the tip of the faucet and are hidden from view. They are also called recessed faucet aerators. Cache aerators can be cleaned the same way. However, you will need a special tool to remove them from your faucet. Cache aerators come in four sizes. Standard is the size of a quarter. Junior is the size of a nickel. Tiny Junior is the size of a penny. And Tom Thumb is roughly the size of a dime. Most faucets with cache aerators are originally packaged with a flat metal or plastic tool that can be placed into the aerator grooves to unscrew it. However, many people don't know what this tool is and may discard it after faucet installation. Most plumbing and hardware stores do not carry the tool. The easiest way to find one is to order a key set from your faucet manufacturer or another online source. An aerator key set comes in two basic styles and should cost about $8. Once acquired, you may wish to store this under your kitchen sink for easy access. To remove a cache aerator, determine which key size fits. Insert the key's grooves into the aerators. Then turn counterclockwise, lefty-loosey, to unscrew. Once the aerator screen and housing are removed from the faucet, clean, then reassemble. For all aerator screens, if your screen does not come clean, do not reinsert the screen into your faucet. You should use your faucet without the aerator until you purchase a new screen insert. Remember, cleaning faucet aerators regularly is an important step in maintaining the highest quality of water flowing out of taps in your home. Cleaning should be done every six months and after a disruption of water service to your home.